Well, hello and welcome back to Tuesdays with Todd. Um, kind of excited about the question today. Uh, the question is actually for a new investor, what is your number one tip? You know, for a new investor, it's really, really, really important to never leave free money on the table. Um, you know, when you're a young investor, you generally have an opportunity to invest in like a 401k or a 403b. And often an employer will match your contributions to that particular account. So never ever leave free money on the table. And also I think the other important thing there is to probably start investing earlier. The earlier you invest, the better off you'll be in retirement. Let's say that you started investing at age 35. You invested $2,000 a year for 10 years at 8%. Now that $2,000 a year equates to about $166, $166 I guess a month. Um, and at the end of the day, at age 65, you would actually have about $135,000 at age 65. However, if you actually delay saving until you're around 45 and you actually invest the same exact amount of money each year at the same interest rate or return, um, and you let that money grow uh, over the same period of time till you reach age 65, you'll actually have approximately around $90,000. So if you just start 10 years earlier, uh, in this particular example, you'll have somewhere in the neighborhood of around $40,000 more money than you will uh, if you delay savings until uh, you're age 45. Just that 10-year window really does make a difference and that equates to about a 48% increase in the amount of dollars that you'll have at age 65. So uh, my number one tip would be to really start early in saving and never ever leave free money on the table. Um, I don't think you'll regret it. So um, look forward to the next time we're together uh, and if you'd really like to ask a question, please leave a comment just below here and go, or go to leaderscu.com slash Todd. Leave that question and I'll be happy to answer those. Have a great day.